Hi guys, today I have created a tutorial on this book which is how to create a winged liner. It's really simple and so easy to do. You can wear this anytime, any day, anywhere. If you want to learn how to create this look on yourself, please keep watching. So I'm going to go in with the Rimmel Exaggerate Noir Eyeliner. I almost always do this when I'm doing a winged liner because it covers up the skin on the inside and it also makes your lashes look thicker. I find the easiest way to do this is to start by looking down and then you draw the line from the outside of your eye along the lash line towards the inner corner. If you're not used to doing this, it might feel a tiny, tiny bit awkward to begin with, but once you've done it a few times, you'll get used to it. I want to finish up the pencil liner by making sure I've coloured in the outer corners of my eye. Then I'm going to take the Maybelline Lasting Drama Gel Eyeliner in the number one black. Cover the entire brush, making it as flat as possible, and I start on the outer third of my eye, a bit out of focus, but we'll get there one minute one minute there we go we start on the outer third and do small strokes towards the outer side of the eye please note how i'm holding the brush i've got the longer end towards the inner side and the shorter end towards the outside and bit by bit i'm using small strokes and etching towards the inner corner of my eye now using smaller strokes will allow you to have more control over your eyeliner. We've all been there when we've done that long flick and we thought what the hell have I done? Now on the inner corner you just want to lightly press and pat that liner into the edge of your lash line. And then you want to go in and draw your wing. Now I find the easiest way to do this is to look straight and by keeping your eyes open you're able to draw the line exactly where you want it to be. You definitely don't want to keep your eyes closed or looking down because more often than not it creates dodgy looking wings and I've been there. And then you want to flip your brush the other way around and start about two thirds the way up the wing and you want to draw a line from this point towards almost the middle of your eye. Then the final thing to do is to connect that end point by smoothing it out a tiny bit. Now you can keep it a kitten wing like this or you can extend it a bit. Now I'm going to go a tiny tiny bit longer. And once I'm happy with the length, I'm going to flip the brush over again and bring that wing down onto the lower lash line. I'm bringing the product down, maybe almost like a quarter of the way down the eye. And then once that's done, I'm taking any black shadow. This is Anastasia Noir, I think, with an Eco Tools brush. And I'm just smoothing out and blending out that lower lash line. I want to clean up the edges a tiny bit, so I'm taking a flat synthetic brush and I'm going to drag this right up against the bottom of the wing. And what it does is it sharpens and it gives like a little trail to your wing, like you can see here. To finish the look, you just need to curl your lashes, add a tiny bit of mascara, and if you want to add lashes, you can do. I didn't add lashes for this look. And there it is! That's the look completed. I hope you were able to find some useful tricks for yourself. If you have any questions, comment below, and if you try out this look, then please show me, hashtag Simsagoo on Instagram, and I hope to see you soon!